Two Ohio State representatives are introducing a bill they say protects free speech on college campuses. But some are worried it could open them up to violent outbursts like we saw in Charlottesville. NBC4's Ohio State House Newsroom reporter Jason Aubrey has the story. The bill seeks to do several things, including protecting students and invited guests' right to speak, regardless of the content. Tuesday, Representatives Wes Goodman and Andy Brenner announced their campus free speech bill. We don't believe that, that, that it is the role of government or the role of university administrators to make decisions about what speech is acceptable or not acceptable. The bill would ensure First Amendment protection in generally accessible areas, provide for content neutral distribution of student activity fees while making those fees optional, and protect students and invited guests' right to speak. We've got a lot of conservative organizations who feel like that they and their speech is being repressed by uh, practices that are occurring uh, throughout the United States. These freedoms would extend to any student or speaker, regardless of the content of their speech or the potential for violent outcomes, like we saw in Charlottesville. In the case of, say, a neo-Nazi were to get violent, they should be arrested and thrown into jail. Um, but they have a right to also stand there whether I agree with them or not. The Ohio State University released a statement today which reads in part, the university has rules and standards that address the usage of the university and our spaces, which apply to students, faculty, staff, and visitors to the university. All rules and standards are consistent with the First Amendment. The representatives say steps should be taken to limit speech only after violence erupts. At the State House, Jason Aubrey, NBC4.